Okay, Omar, a very warm welcome to Forest Green Rovers. You've obviously signed after a week training with the club. How do you feel now you've put pen to paper? Uh, happy. I mean, I knew there was interest sort of from, from higher up, so, so I thought if I come down, show what I've got, what I've got to offer, sort of thing, there's a high chance to get signed, and obviously that actually, that actually happened. So I'm quite pleased, sort of thing. Have you found the experience so far in the week you've been with the squad? Um, really enjoyed it. You can just tell the standards really high. Players have shown they've got experience to play that sort of level, and I definitely enjoyed it being around them because you just pick up a few things straight away how they play, how they communicate to each other. So, really enjoyed it. And you must feel playing a little bit higher with maybe a little bit pair of players that actually raises your game and you've had to match that? Massively. Like when, when you play obviously lower division, you can just sort of tell who's on it, who's not. And especially when you play high up in division, you can tell everyone's on it. And definitely, if you don't do your job, people tell you to do it and obviously motivate you to do to well, get where you want to go to so definitely. You've scored a fair few goals this season and previous seasons as well but you must be obviously you know, desperate to get the opportunity at a little bit higher level and what a fantastic platform to go and do that with. And that's right I mean it's a higher division so I've got to prove myself um, if I get a chance to play I'm definitely going to give 100% so that's what it's all about isn't it just wait for the opportunity be patient and make sure you support the teammates when they're on the pitch when I'm not playing so just going to wait up and see. Definitely, and when we are going to see you out on the pitch, Omar, what sort of striker are we going to see playing for Forest Green? Um, I'm definitely going to be working my socks off. I've always been like that. I mean, work rate is the main thing. Um, if it doesn't go your way, you still got to work hard because you never know. I mean, it only takes one chance to score a goal, doesn't it? So support, support your teammates. Make sure we hopefully win the game. And then. Yeah, definitely, and you know we've seen lots of players at Forest Green come here from a lower levels and go on to have you know, play higher up the pyramid. You know, obviously, there's the great stories like Jamie Vardy and so on. Um, obviously, you would never know what's going to happen with yourself, but this is the correct direction. This is the great direction for you to be heading in. Um, that's how it works these days. Like non-league players stepping up from league to league, sort of thing, and I definitely want to be part of it. Like, I've worked myself over the last few years, especially after my injury. So, I want to give it a shot this this sort of division and. See what I've got to offer, really, and hopefully kick on from there, and then we'll okay. see. And in terms of your career, obviously you've come from Worthing. Is there any other spells you've had in your career? Um, start off playing for Salesy football clubs, like a t t small village. Mm. Like Adam Hinchwood, he was the manager. He used to play for Brighton back in the days. So, um, he he sort of um, saw me playing, and I signed for them. And then from there on, I went to Burgess Hill Football Club, and then back to Salesy. Got injured, and then went to Worthing Football Clubs because Adam Hinchwood was there. So he gave me the opportunity to play man's football. And ever since, well, I don't really look back. I mean, took my opportunities and here, here we are. Yeah, and pretty exciting for you then to get away from maybe that area of the country and actually try something on a national scale with the National League. Yeah, it's a, it's a big league, isn't it? It's like just one, just, just one below league football. Mm. So hopefully it's not going to be too tough, but um, I'm, def I'm sure I can adapt to it. It's going to take a few training sessions but, um, or games, but I'm sure I'll be fine.